In this video, I'm going to show you how to mount MioDAC on a flat panel or on a DIN rail. Another way to look at it is I'm going to show you mounting it like this, like this, or like this, using the accessory kit. In the accessory kit, you get the metal mounting bracket, a DIN clip, you get four screws that are tapered and countersunk so they fit flush with the metal. You also get another USB-C cable. It's a USB-C on both ends, but one side is a right angle. And you'll see why that's important once I install this in the bracket. Uh, all right, so let's get to it. I'm going to start by mounting MioDAC on the bracket. Uh, I have two sets of holes. There's two holes on the back of MioDAC, and there's two pairs here. And the reason for that is if I choose the pair that's far out, I have space to remove the cable. I can plug it in and remove it while it's mounted. If I want, I can plug the cable in and then mount it on the close screws, and then the cable will be captive. I will not be able to remove it. So your choice. I'm going to go ahead and do it on the one where I can remove the cable. So I'm just going to drop the screw in, Get start a little bit. screw that down. So what we've seen is that a lot of engineers, once they take to move their test off of the, the workbench or the desktop, uh, have to get kind of creative for mounting. And so we've seen bungee cords, we've seen duct tape, uh, we've seen a lot of different ways to do it. So that's why we designed these accessories for MioDAC. Uh, okay, so I've got that connected. And so I should have enough space to bring back my USB-C cable with the right angle. And it clicks in. And so I've got a nice right angle, drops it straight down. And then I can mount this on a wall using the keyholes. And so that's one, one way to mount it, flat on a wall. And go ahead and take the cable off, just make it easier on me. Because the other thing you can do, you can still mount it vertically, but on a DIN rail. And to do that, we have a DIN rail clip. And there's four holes. Two of the holes are for the horizontal mount. And then two of the holes are if I want to rotate it and mount it on a DIN rail straight out. So you have a wide variety of options. Now the last thing I want to show you is you don't have to, if you want to do a DIN rail mount, you can just buy separate accessory, just this clip. Just the DIN rail clip and two screwdriver, uh, two screws. So no bracket. Move that off to the side. So separate accessory, just a DIN rail clip. And the holes on MioDAC fit the DIN rail clip as well. And so this is how you would mount MioDAC like this on a DIN rail. All right, so whether it's like this or this or like this. The panel mount accessory kit for MioDAC is going to help you mount MioDAC when you need to move your test off your desk.